Haley T with Country Music News Blog, and I'm here with Greg Bates. Hey, how you doing? I'm good. How are you? Good. Um, so your show, you just got done. Just literally walked off, off stage. Yeah. Um, how did you like it? It was awesome. It was awesome. It was such a cool event up here with all the different artists and all the different types of music that seemed to kind of come together for this this weekend. But it, it was really cool to be a part of it and just you know get to come come play for everybody. So is this your first time at Vama Jam? It is, it is, and I'm excited and I hope we get to come back. Not your last time. Hopefully. So, <laughs> hopefully so, yeah. So what have you been doing so far this summer? Well, we just had uh, my, my first single, Did It For The Girl, came out about seven, eight weeks ago, mm -hmm. and uh, we just shot the video for that this past week, and so we're just gearing up for all that. It's in the top 40 right now, and um, I think we're putting out an EP of probably five tracks off the record mm -hmm. uh, in July. So we're, we're gearing up for all that and just uh, out playing some shows and trying to introduce myself to the, the country fan base this summer. Mm -hmm. So when do you think that that video will be out? Do you have a time? Uh, not sure since we just shot it, mm -hmm. but um, you know, hopefully sometime in July mm -hmm. it'll come out and be... It's a good summertime video we shot down in Tampa, Florida. Awesome. So it should be good. That's exciting. Yeah. So um, what's going to be on your EP? Uh, it'll be, uh, we're still in the process of figuring that out, but mm -hmm. it'll be, I think, four or five tracks off of my record, which is done right now. We're just kind of, you know, going to put out four or five songs that have been going over really well live and and uh, see if we can't get some traction that way. Mm -hmm. So what is the song, do you think, other than your single, that has people just really drawn well, I've, I've got a song called Brothers that's on my record that I, it's the only song I wrote by myself and I wrote it about six years ago when I was in college and I just, it, it's a song that, that I wrote from at three o'clock in the morning in a dorm room mm -hmm. and about my younger brother and just some of the, the stuff we'd been through and it seems to be really hitting with people. It's kind of a tearjerker. It kind of <laughs> is, yeah. Well, and it made my mom cry, but I thought she was a little biased. But, you know, um, it, it's going over really well, and it's just, it's really cool to see the reaction from people. You know, we got moms that have sons and grandparents and, and that kind of thing. It's just, you know, it's it's definitely, it's a bigger song than what I ever thought it would be, and okay. we're just kind of in the early stages of it, so it's really cool. That's a good song. Well, um... I think that's all we need for today, but thank you, and we're really looking forward to your album and EP. Thank you very much. We're definitely going to get that and have a listen. Awesome. Thank, thank you. you.